Stuart Hour, seventh away draw in the league this season. On the balance of play overall, do you think that's a fair reflection of the game, the 1 1? Yeah, they are. Man, when you look at it, they had a lot of the ball, but defensively, they didn't break us down many times. Gooley, did he have many saves? Probably not. So, in terms of away performance, effort, desire to defend, can't fault the lads really. And we took the lead after soaking up a bit of pressure. We simply played on the counter attack a lot in the first half. That's how the goal came. A really good goal as well. Was that kind of the game plan in the first half? Yeah, I think when you come, we knew they were going to have possession, just the way they play. Uh, especially coming away, if you have to soak it up for ta a bit of time. But we've got lads that can break, and we, at speed, Rama, means Tyler. He can run and just keep running. So yeah, I think you just have to be willing to soak stuff up at times and not have the ball. And that's what I said to the lads in the changing room. Really, you can't, don't worry that you haven't got the ball all the time. You've just got to be patient with your shape and play from there. And that's where your counter attacks. And Jason spoke last week after the defeat against Kevin about game management. Was it really disappointing and frustrating to concede just four minutes after taking the lead? Yeah, it's been. I think it's been since I come in. That's been mentioned a few times. Like scoring and then conceding straight away. Um, is there something to look at? You're just saying we just looked a bit stretched after scoring, which is probably the opposite of what we want. Like score if we score and then just like settle into that shape again. Uh, maybe they're eager to go and press too much because we scored. Um, but yeah, there was a, even before the goal, there was two. They had two or three chances. The free kick Glenn cleared off the line. Um, but overall, probably is a fair result. We've had good chances, um, again on the break, a few from set pieces. So I think we'll go on pretty happy. In the second half, did you feel the game was there for the take and it was kind of a half where there were not many clear cut chances at all? No, I think, yeah. I think, like you said, Gouldy's had nothing to do second half. Chambers had a header late on, but apart from that, there's no real threat. Two centre halves are brilliant, um, two full backs again. And then the rest of the lads, have made, the shape might look like 4-2-4 four, four at times, but it doesn't matter if you get a chance on the counter-attack. And it was just taking one of the good opportunities we had on the counter-attack. We had four or five really good opportunities in terms of getting into good areas. It was just end product, really. And in a league as competitive as this one as the National League North, do you think picking up points like this away from home and then winning your home games and making a bit of a fortress, that's the key to kind of pushing up the table? I mean, if you can do that, you're, you're laughing. Um, Again, if the lads are willing to defend like that, it just has to be every game. <laughs> if you can, you're going to get, as, you, as I've seen in the past, you're going to score goals, just the way it is. Um, and as if we can just tighten that little bit up at the back, don't concede. I know we're not going to keep clean sheets every game, but um, clean sheets at home are massive because you're always, you're always going to score at home. Um, and then you're flying, aren't you? You only need to, if you can keep a clean, few clean sheets, you're going to go on a five game run. Like, that's just the way it is, and then you're flat, then you're like looking that way rather than behind.